Blaine, this is your first video. Um, this is not your swing. Uh, this is actually Adam Scott, and I'll just loop this through. This is a slow motion, but it's pr arguably the best swing on the on the tour. Uh, so you can just loop this through your your uh, your PC and uh, and grain it. Here's points of interest. At this point, the club is overlapping his hands. The shaft is parallel and on top of his foot line, toe line. Elbows and hands are in front of his chest. The club shaft is pointed at the ball. The top. See, see the width? See how his elbows are still in front of his chest? Left arm's extended. That's his top position. So he doesn't go any further than that. Now watch the lower body start. So by the time his hands get down to about his chest, his lower body, uh, his belt buckle is actually pointed at the ball now. And then it's leading through impact. So look at this right here. This is beautiful. That left hip pocket comes away from the ball. Double cheek at impact. Head stays in. Retains the spine angle. Exits. Near perfect swing. Let's go from this angle. Now let's take a look at uh, what I've done is this eight step swing I put on your CD. You can print it out and I might give you a hard copy of it also. Um, you know, pretty good setup. This is kind of the death move. You're kind of pinched in here. See how your elbows are kind of close to your chest? You know, then, then uh, as it comes down, it flies out here. No double cheek and impact, and and go through. But let's look at let's put some motion to this. So here, we want you to be right here. And I actually have a picture at the end of the lesson. Your club was actually about in here, so you had shaved off maybe a foot and a half. You know, you make a good correction here. So you just kind of bunched in there. Not much width. Now here's the here's the death move. See this? Hands go out, breaks the plane. Really gets outside the plane here. So the only thing that can happen is club has to go back inside so you're going to pull this ball might have come off the hosel but trust me that's a pull swing and then the one thing so I don't want to make this too long but here's your shaft line your swing plane is anything parallel to that line kind of along this quarter and every time you break it you've got to have a compensating move to break it so you broke the plane there you've got a compensated move here now you're on plane now you're not you're still not cast it outside you're on plane now but it's outside the plane so you're going to be scrubbing across it so that's the thing that we have to fix and the next thing is the lower body movement that's causing your causing a lot of problems but um, the main one is your balance got to keep your lower body in this box the entire trip comes off the back wall just a bit but that's not bad kind of this knee out here 
I want to get it closer to the box. And what happens is as you come down, your belt buckle goes towards the ball, and it shouldn't. See, this little move here is killing you. See how your, your hip pockets are coming away from the wall? Belt buckle is going towards the ball. When that happens, you have to lose your spine angle. So this spine angle will be way different than what it was at, at a dress, I can guarantee you. has to watch so you end up coming away momentum so if this is a center line here in order you you can't keep leaned over it leaned over the ball without falling and because you're all your weights going to the right of this center line that's how sometimes you kind of fall out of it that was a pretty good swing there balance wise so and the final look is because your hips are in the way, it really hasn't cleared at impact. Your hips in the way, you got a chicken wing thing here. If you clear that hip to that point, then you can have both arms straight. And you watch at uh, Adam Scott swing or any any good golfer swing at this point both arms are straight out here this see it's it's kind of like a v there because you really haven't cleared your hips so it's coming in at this angle and it's leaving at that angle so you're only in the hitting area for a short time the good guys the guys who get paid for this stuff you know, have a, they call it a flat spot down here. Well, you get the picture there, flat spot's better. Better, it's more long here. I mean, so you come out, and that's only in the hitting area for a short time. Yeah.